Well, hello everybody. Hey, we're getting ready to start a new week. I just got to tell you something. It is like 36 degrees here this morning, and I've got a light jacket on here, and I got my sweatshirt on, and then I got a long sleeve shirt on. I'm going to tell you something. It's a little chilly here this morning, but I have to tell everybody that I love it. I absolutely love this time of year. I do not look forward to what's coming, though, the freezing temperatures, but hey, I am very thankful to God for this day to day, for a fact. And you know, the Lord has put it on my heart today to share a little bit about the book of Jonah. You know, the book of Jonah is an interesting book. There's so much great stuff in that book. I realize that the story goes that Jonah went out and ran from God and some guy he got on a boat and he was running from God and the guys threw him over the overboard and he got swallowed by a well and then he finally came to his senses and asked forgiveness and what happens next the well kicks him out on the beach and he's forgiven and he goes and does what it is that he needs to do for the country of Nineveh to the Ninevites, pre preaches to them God's word, finally, and they come back to God. So it all worked out the way it was supposed to work out. But, you know, what really the Lord has put on my, my heart to share about this story is this. No matter what it is that we have going on in our lives, no matter what it is that's going on in our lives has gone on in our lives the fact is is that we have a loving god who is willing to forgive us friend i do not know what it is in your life but i will tell you this if you get on your knees and truly ask god to forgive you his word says that he will now that is some great news that we can go out with this week whatever it is that's going on in your life don't forget about the story of Jonah and how Jonah ran from God. But yet when he came back to God, God was sure to forgive him. Friend, that same promise is very much as alive today for you and me as it was for Jonah then. So whatever it is that's going on in your life, get down on your knees, ask forgiveness, and get moving forward in your life doing the things that God would want you to be doing. That's, that's it. Outside of that, it is very simple. We cannot do anything upon our own. I mean, it's clear in the Bible that our best is filthy rags. But you know what? Whenever we bring things to God and He gets involved, He forgives us, we get on with living, life is good. And that's His promise. Do not let anything beat you down or feel like you should be beat down. Don't do it to yourself because God's promise is come back to me and I will forgive you. Go back to Him and be forgiven. And let that peace beyond understanding come over you, friend. That's His promise for all of us. Till next week, God bless.